my presentation is about uh, software freedom, and I try to check the history of uh, TDF, but later uh, uh, later uh, change the topic. But the most important thing related to the development of LibreOffice, I think, will be in, in, in the first uh, slides. So the first question is, uh, in my presentation, do we have to uh, have Asperger syndrome or HD? HD to carry a free software community on our backs. Uh, not, uh, but can help. For example, hyper-focusing on uh, programming, it's a real advantage if you uh, want to uh, make something uh, in a very complex thing that understanding part of a very small part of six million uh, program lines, it, it, uh, you, need, uh, you need to try to close the outside uh, from your mind to, to understand uh, some part, a little part of that little part of the six million uh, program codes. Do we have to be a psychopath to break up a free software community? Uh, not, but can help. So it's very easy to uh, lose yourself. For example, you have a pain related to the accident, uh, a knee or shoulder. Uh, accident and uh, the part of the treatment to use painkillers. And uh, according to the recent scientific research, is uh, eating uh, painkiller pills every day, day by day, re uh, result, uh, it will be result some, some uh, psychopathic uh, symptoms, losing the uh, capability to, to feel or understand the other, uh, the feelings of other people. And uh, very similar to pay killers, for example, the, the Botox uh, uh, treatment for, uh, for people, not only women, but uh, men, it's very common, especially because there is a huge of money uh, in Botox. And the symptoms is the similar, losing your empathy. So be avoid. Uh, the about losing our community in the last year, uh, uh, lost uh, one of uh, our founders, founders of the uh, founder of the TDF Foundation, uh, Jan Holesowski, or uh, well known uh, with his well known uh, nickname uh, Candy. This is a picture in the, from uh, uh, when, uh, 2008 uh, when uh, there was a uh, open office dot conference in Beijing, China. So this is the. Great Wall. We can feel the, that we, we, we climbed the Great Wall during uh, our journey, uh, in literally, to not only in by numbers, uh, the, about the numbers. A uh, few months uh, ago, Thorsten Behrens, uh, the chair of the foundation, shared a, a slideshow about the healthiness of the key uh, uh, e community. And the part of the report was a formal that, uh, a tool which used to generate some interesting charts about how uh, uh, a healthy uh, free software community. It, this slide shows that the number and the uh, fidelity of uh, the code contributors of uh, the LibreOffice code base, uh, starting with the open uh, dark times. The, the color shows the year when that contributor or contributors uh, uh, joined to the development. And uh, you can see the, in the top uh, part of the chart or the columns, this uh, light yellow uh, color, this uh, means the one-time contributors, contributing only a single year. But after that, later, uh, there was no other contribution. So it's the lowest uh, fidelity uh, in this chart. Uh, you can see the numbers, the number of the authors. There are near 100 or 75 uh, in, uh, new buys, uh, new com commerce uh, every year, but later we lose them somehow, fixing some minor thing or, or, or something. And you can see the uh, contributors since uh, uh, 2009 uh, or later. It's related somehow the uh, the history of the foundation. I put some uh, uh, labels, captions to the chart to, to see the, the 
bigger events of the history of the foundation, you can see that there are a lot of a huge amount of uh, contributors who uh, get a very high fidelity starting to develop in the, according to the chart in 2009, but uh, because changing the uh, email address in the code, it's, 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 it doesn't notice that there are developers who started uh, in the uh, star division time before uh, 2000 uh, or that time, so it's not correct the chart, but it's, it's, it's a good start to understand uh, our problems. The next uh, uh, char uh, chart generated by this former der tour is the commits by domains. Uh, commits of the uh, free software ecosystem uh, foundations, uh, uh, commits of volunteers, and uh, co uh, there are commits from a single person who are very active. For instance, Andreas Gelmini uh, from Italy, he, he, he uh, uh, frequently or uh, try to make the typos, the English language uh, spelling mixta mistakes in the comments. So it's, uh, it's, it's uh, one uh, type of the contributions, uh, code uh, cleanup, or this, uh, in this case, the, the comment cleanup. It's uh, useful because I know a lot of uh, people who are very angry to see, uh, seeing uh, spelling mistakes. I, I was the developer of Hunspel Spellchecker, with, uh, which uh, based on the My Spell Spellchecker, created by uh, Kevin Hendricks and uh, uh, other volunteers. So I can understand very well that we need to fix all the spelling mistakes in the uh, code. Thank you very much, Andras Galmini, and uh, I hope uh, uh, next uh, year or, or, or later we can, we can enjoy this type of uh, contributions. And uh, there is, for example, uh, Julian Nabet, uh, uh, a, lot of, a lot of code contributions, mostly cleanup, but uh, in, uh, always there are very crucial, uh, the bigger, not, on, not a clear code cleanup, but fixing real problems. So it's a type of the contributions. It's, uh, yesterday I, I had a presentation about the flow, this uh, positive psy psychological term about that you need to try to focus on the best work uh, for you. So if you want to uh, fix spelling mistakes, uh, do it, because uh, may, uh, that is the best for our community to create a, a, a fun project when everyone uh, can, can choose the best a task and later improve themselves. So it's a good thing to uh, improve. And the, the main meaning of the this, uh, statistics that the most of the uh, contributors somehow came from the uh, free software ecosystem uh, uh, companies. Or there are a, a few peop people, very important people, showing that a very important problem in the, uh, our uh, community. It's very hard to keep or focus on the contribution for a long time. So I know uh, programmers, both uh, or more for every uh, uh, companies who change, changing his job, trying to work in the company and later trying to uh, volunteer, doing uh, other things and later uh, uh, coming back. And because it's uh, trying to mix the, the, the work and the, and uh, the ho not the, the hobby is a very good, good way, but my, with my English, I don't, I don't, I, I cannot find the right term for it. it. But um, uh, you can uh, check the colors uh, later. There are uh, in the graphics uh, you can see another important thing that the decreasing the community. I mentioned Jan Holasowski, Candy, who was a founder, and he was a uh, one of the main contributors at the start of the open office, of, uh, uh, at the start of the LibreOffice um, uh, project or development. So it's a question that uh, how can we help uh, this community? What, uh, and there with the light on the recent problems, uh, I tr uh, try to create a slideshow, maybe uh, creating uh, some, uh, talking about the, uh, the reasons why somebody tried to contribute LibreOffice or and the TDF, the, the uh, foundation and uh, our free software 
community that it's my business cards. So it's important to take business cards. My business uh, was uh, in, uh, at the openoffice.org time to be a free software uh, activist. And uh, because I, I worked, we translated the, all the uh, uh, comments and uh, uh, partially document, make, making documentation uh, in the open source of time. It, it was a community event. There is a foundation, fsf.hu uh, foundation, with a, a few core members. And uh, it's interesting that this foundation uh, still works. So <laughs> I think it's a. <laughs> Good thing to see a uh, foundation from the, the uh, maybe from 2003, that was the time. So it's a good example to be an activist in a, a, a good uh, free software foundation. This is my work for the government. It was an EU supported project when I was a leader of the development, but in fact, there was only one program at me, so it's very easy to be the leader of the de development if there is only one uh, real uh, developer in that uh, stuff. So uh, it was a very long, uh, short project, uh, half a year. So, but it was very important for me uh, to to try to understand free software more, uh, reading a lot of uh, materials from the EU uh, EU side. And this, it's it's not. Uh, in fact. Uh, it was originally there was something hidden. So, but I will send a better PDF version. In fact, on my machine, the game started to annoy some library. Thank you very much. That <laughs> maybe I hope in the video. But uh, here is in the last business card is member uh, of the board of the TDF Foundation, uh, and I I can I will share some experience. Maybe I'm very. Uh, I will be very fast, sorry, sorry, but I will try to focus on the most important thing. There uh, never was a democracy yet that did not commit suicide. So it's a, and the antidote of the, uh, this uh, real problem is the, the knowledge, the education. That was the, in the time of the uh, founding fathers and the French Revolution when the, the education was the most important, the public education for everyone. An analogy, the Germanic fight, you know the, the, when uh, 150 members died. It's an analogy related to one uh, person or uh, something can generate a, a much bigger problem. I was interesting uh, knowing the, the, in the news that it's related to uh, uh, depression, etc., etc. And after that, I, I uh, read a report from uh, Agnes Heller, a Hungarian philosopher, a worldwide uh, well-known uh, philosopher, who he said that, uh, she said that it's, it's very important. It's, it's this evil, evilness. No, no, nothing more about it. This is a, a, a short uh, a part of, uh, of his, uh, if you her book, about the uh, uh, Holocaust, how she survived. He was, she was the bravest uh, uh, woman. Uh, he, uh, she literally uh, escaped her, uh, other, uh, her own mother from the ghetto and from, from the, uh, at the Nunau when the, uh, all the other uh, members uh, killed. And the main problem for her that he, uh, she uh, couldn't able to save his uh, child, uh, um, friend, uh, his friend, uh, young boy, 16 years old, uh, Yuri Bihari. Uh, in the last uh, uh, years, I tried to understand the uh, thinking of the foundation, and, and uh, within a few uh, weeks ago, I found uh, a book in the local library. So it, that book uh, it was the uh, Snakes in Suits, when uh, psychopaths go to work. So I, I can show you the book that, uh, yes, it's a library book, so I, I, I must, uh, I, I must do, be careful about it, but it's a textbook. A textbook about the details. So that's what, in the last uh, few weeks, I tried to understand and collecting all the things. The one of the first rule never, never say something about it that uh, it's a psychopath. Maybe because uh, uh, Machiavellism or narcissism, there are other problems. Never, never say. So I, 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 I didn't, but I tried to collect the. the Act or fact in the uh, foundation. I collected a list. My plan to send to the MC of the uh, foundation. 
uh, trying to understand the, the problems a little bit better. Uh, this is my uh, uh, bookmark in one of the books when I uh, try to collect here, because I love uh, books, uh, books. And uh, this, uh, I got this uh, bookmark from my, from my daughter. I uh, never focused it in her too much, so I'm not, not, the, not the best father, maybe. But uh, in my, I found it uh, within uh, the last week in my English book. And uh, I, uh, I checked that. It's not nice. From uh, nine years ago, I've got this, uh, I love the LibreOffice. Uh, uh, there was a sticker made by uh, Core uh, as a, a gift on the conferences. And my daughter uh, uh, found it and made a, a bigger version from it. And uh, there is... Uh, her name and uh, time, 2014. So and uh, and the day and the time. So not only the day. So it's uh, it's like you can you can so see. It. So uh, here's my daughter now in, in a medical uh, university sec uh, second uh, uh, grade with uh, her classmates and in the, our sit uh, my city our city the Seged and uh, there is a statue here Albert Sanger the Nobel Prize winner found in this vitamin C and uh, the, the uh, muscle structure, bio biochemist uh, studied in uh, England, but uh, uh, he made the uh, most important scientific research in Szeged, in South Hungary. And uh, here is the school of my all three children. And uh, so, Love is a kind of welfare. It's a deep state movie. I like movies with my wife. I checked this uh, movie last week. And uh, this is a, a quotient. Love is a kind of welfare. It's, it's from Ovid, the Latin uh, poet, one of the, uh, the biggest uh, Latin poets from the free one, in the first. But uh, he uh, exi exiled and he died uh, within six years near Bucharest in uh, Constanza. And uh, he his books was uh, forbidden in the Middle Age because love is war, it, is a, it, it was a symbol of something more uh, deeper. So about the freedom of uh, the humanity or uh, humankind. Other books, uh, one I, this story I, I heard that was this uh, book, the Papyrus. It's about the our culture, the Greek and Latin culture with a, a lot of interesting things, but a lot of uh, fearful things about the, the books. And this is other my favorite book, the Polgar uh, chess book. It's, uh, I was able to create a, a free software based on this book. I, I will check some examples. This is the Polgar uh, 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 sisters, an experiment on hum, uh, the human, human with uh, his father tried to, to teach them to, to chess. And the left side, the youngest one, Judith Polgar, uh, this is the, the first uh, Olympic when Judith uh, Polgar was uh, 12 years old, and uh, they ruled the Soviet uh, chess. Uh, the, the, they uh, won the prize in, in uh, Saloniki. And uh, in that time, uh, Kasparov uh, checked the ma match and said something that uh, he, uh, she, very talented Judith Polgar, became a, a female world uh, championship some, some uh, time somewhere. Here is a, 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 a man theme, uh, uh, ch uh, game or uh, world championship when Judith Polgar and uh, Kasparov uh, uh, doing chess. And this is last year when Judith Polgar, uh, when he, uh, there was a world championship in Madrid, an ex exhibition, heard about in the taxi that uh, Carson in a local park in Madrid uh, uh, playing uh, uh, chess. So. Uh, Judith Polgar said to the taxi driver that go where, and uh, she was able to uh, defeat uh, Magnus Carlsen, the world champion, in a uh, rapid uh, chess game. So you can check the video. It's, uh, the interesting thing is what about, the, so it's nurture or nature. What is the origin of the uh, human uh, uh, creativeness? And uh, you can check the, in the background the mother of the daughters. And uh, if you, I will attach some story to the to spot. And uh, the love is the key here. Not only the, the creativeness, but loving in a way to create something new. This is my my uh, free software. One of the first first free softwares when published under the new 
public license, vector graphics, but it's a working uh, version of the chess game. You can create a simultan uh, with, with very uh, small tables and vector graphics uh, uh, playing uh, games. And last week I checked it because it was originally in Kylix, uh, Linux ver uh, version of, of uh, uh, a, pro a protected uh, environment. I checked the Lazarus version and it works, still works my program, but I used the uh, backway machine from Sun Microsystem originally to found my own code. So I, I, it was lost for me, but thanks to the Sun Microsystem, I was able to last minute. Yeah. Last minute. This is my other tool to create an old machine, an education tool using uh, the old bitmap uh, uh, interface showing the bits, state of the bits of the Ural machine. And uh, this is my other book, which is very important for me. The part of the book is, is uh, the first page is, is part of the LibreOffice code because as a dummy text or lorem issum, I put in the Hungarian language part of the LibreOffice. So I, I will uh, talk about, it's about uh, creativity, braveness, and much more. And this is my favorite uh, po poem. And uh, you can see that it's, uh, it's written with pencil. It's not so bad. It's found in a, in a, within the uh, uh, body of the dead. Uh, man after the World War II, and this was, uh, this is the, uh, the poet when, uh, when I, I cannot uh, uh, read it, uh, I, sorry, I cannot read it, I have no time, but uh, it's about the, about the responsibility of the, 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 the clever man. It's, it's, that is the German uh, sentence, but the, the poet was, uh, was shot by a Hungarian, a Hungarian soldier. So not a German. It's about our responsibility here. And he is, uh, he is a Miklos Rad noted poet. And his wife uh, died in, uh, in, in her age in uh, 202. He was, uh, she was uh, 200 year, years old. As, as a symbol, some way, the memory of uh, his husband. And this is my uh, town in uh, 1876. I mentioned, I've tried to mention that the road, uh, broad uh, avenues, and uh, not so common in South Hungary, that this is the reason that this river destroyed all my uh, uh, town that time. And all the European capitals collected money, donated money to create that uh, town with a university, with a Nobel Prize in their uh, uh, scientists. And one of the uh, capitals was Bucharest. Thank you very much, Bucharest. <laughs>